seems that Mr. Han, Han Sung Su is also on the board of Standard Chartered Bank, which was awarded according to the, the most recent report of the, on the Chief Executive Board's proceedings. Uh, Standard Chartered Bank was awarded the UN's master servicing banking contract. So I wanted to know, I mean, this is why I think I was asking for a kind of a more comprehensive response from the Ethics Office in terms of how, what restrictions they've placed on Mr. Han Sung Su. Because if, as is reflected by the bank's website, he's on the board of a bank that in fact has this major contract with the UN, can you please describe to me what possible restrictions deal with this? I've, I've described to you how the Ethics Office's guidelines work and that those guidelines apply to Mr. Han Sung Su. He has engaged and informed them of a number of his business dealings and they have taken those into account. How can he be on the board of a, of the, of a bank that has a, a – you just made a point of pointing out that Doosan, although it's listed in the procurement contract, procurement database, didn't have contracts during this particular period of time. But if – I'm, I'm informing you that the Chief Executive Board's report says that Standard Chartered Bank has this contract with the UN and he's on their board. So is he still on their board or is he somehow I, half on their I've, board? I've, How does I've, it work? I've described you – I've described you what the series of procedures are. And those are what applies to, to him as well as to other special advisors. So how is we're not we're not going to uh, interfere with their own outside of UN lives by going into all of their details at uh, at great length, but uh, but the ethics office uh, has been dealing with this, and they have a series of guidelines, of, and he's aware of them. How and, can and you be on compliant. the board of a corporation? You keep interrupting. All right, me. I'm asking because I see you already looking away, and I want to. This I, is a I'm very looking, simple question. I'm looking at, a, at someone else who's raising a hand, sure. but but please behave yourself. You need to understand that when someone is asking a question, you allow them to answer. I've actually lost my train of thought, so I'll have to. to, to I'm just asking. It. I'm willing because to because I have a follow up the, question. Because is, the continued interruptions, you're doing mm -hmm. it again, actually break people's train of thought. Mm -hmm. He. Uh, he has uh, been in touch with the ethics office, they, and like I said, they have a series of remedies for the, the steps, which I've detailed. Beyond that, uh, this, this is what we have. What other boards is he on? Uh, That's my follow-up uh, question. It's Ma simple, Matthew, it's simple, Ma because Matthew, he's on the board of a Matthew, bank that does business Matthew, with the UN. I'm I've, finishing my question. You're cutting me off. My question no, is, uh, how many corporate boards that do Matthew, business with when, the UN? Matthew, when I start to say something in reply to your question, and then you cut me off, then don't right, accuse me of talking, cutting you off. Right, you finished talking, then you tried to call on someone else, no. and I was asking another question. How many boards is Han Sung Su on that do business with the UN? Uh, at, the, at this stage, you're actually just trying to bully me. To be honest, I've given you a wealth of information about this, including uh, details about how the ethics office goes about it. That, that's what we've got. Yes, Carol.